What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Let's Play Death Row to Canada with Dog and Pony. I'm Dog and Pony, and this is Death Row to Canada. Let's jump right back in. I am coming in hot off of the uh, last episode. I checked my video encoder settings, made sure it recorded fine. It actually looks pretty good. I don't... Let, let's, let's get into this. I don't know why, at the beginning of every video, there's a weird pixelation effect and like it's, it looks corrupted and then out of nowhere it, it clears up and everything's fine from there on out. I don't know why that happens. If anyone has some insight on that, let me know. I'd like to get rid of it. It doesn't really impact anything because it's just the start screen. Glimmer of Hope. Another another one right to start with. It's pretty nice. Morale and random skill gain is probably what I'm going to do because... Medical's kind of useless. Uh, dust and full heal. Entirely useless. Fitness. Does that even help the dogs? See, that's what I'm not sure of. I think fitness doesn't do anything for dogs. So I just want to do morale and random skill gain and kind of hope for something better. And since we can use the morale, it's probably worth it. If, if we had higher morale, I would just go with fitness and take that risk. But I'm going to go morale and random skill gain. I always feel the need to justify that, but I also feel like it's the best one. I just think maybe other people don't know it's the best one, so that's why I always come up with these justifications. Morale's going up, up, up. We got medical, fine. Strength, good. Mechanical, okay. I might have missed one or only three. Oh, I might have missed it again. I don't know if four things got trained or if three things got trained. The group finds a large campsite that is occupied by a few carloads of other survivors. We're going to camp with them and hope for the best. In normal mode, can they even get the uh, robbing us thing? Let's camp with them. We got the good one. One of the other groups learns about the trip to Canada. They give you some supplies because they say you'll need it more than they will. That's 17 pistol ammo, 10 rifle ammo. Don't really care about those. Five food is great. That's a day's worth. Uh, two medical. Cool. Morale goes up and up. So now only dog and pony isn't at full morale, and he's just one short of it. That's fantastic. This canned food is a lot better when you're able to heat it up. After this episode, I will be taking my dog for a walk. The group finds a candy bar on the side of the road. It's fun size. Dog and pony can have it. His morale is now full as well. And then I'm going to come back here and keep recording Death Road to Canada uh, so I can get it good over the weekend oh i'm doing the live stream on saturday i'm doing the live stream tomorrow yeah this, it feels so rushed i don't like that but i don't want to wait any longer it's been so long since we hit 100 subscribers the zombies in the city have stirred we're gonna go to the i don't want to go to either of these camp supply shop i guess i actually i regret that decision we might get some ammo, some guns. I'm going to put the grenade away. All right. Woo. Um. Yeah, let's just loot. See what we can get. We'll probably get some food from these houses. That's helpful. If you you might be saying if if you're if you're new to this game or new to uh or you know, just haven't seen a lot of stuff in this game restaurants have a surprisingly small amount of food maybe they changed that or fixed it or something but every time we've ever uh, gone to a restaurant one you get food out of the houses and stuff but the restaurant itself has little to no food in it oh thanks for picking up that gun dog that cannot shoot guns that's fine the dogs will be able to shoot guns if they're if when, when Dog and Pony leaves, I think? Maybe not. They That used to be a thing. I actually, I think I recall them changing that at some point before I stopped. They, uh, they made it so sometimes it still happens where once uh, there are no people left in the party, dogs become smart dogs and can um, shoot guns and walk on their back legs and stuff like that and drive the car and all that but now like they they get the ability to drive the car but they don't necessarily get the ability to shoot guns i think i'm not 100 percent on that so don't take my word for it 
All right. Here we go. Ooh, more rooms and a cabinet. I wasn't expe I was expecting a little bit of loot in here. I wasn't expecting a another door off of it. This is a pretty big house from the looks of it. I wonder how close we are to a toilet, JD. I have no reference point for like when the last one was or anything like that. We could be at six toilets opened. We could be at 98 toilets opened. I do not have any clue. We can check at the main menu, but who cares? Let's keep it a mystery. Let's be surprised. Or not. Tell me if you want me to just check. Also, this video, the comments on this video, uh, are that's that's the last chance you have to tell me where you want me to do the live stream tomorrow, or if you think I should wait until the uh, 18th. I don't want to wait until the 18th. We could realistically be at like 150 or more subscribers by that point, and doing a hundred subscriber special that long. At, oh crap! Oh goodness! Let's start shooting. Take care of that guy. All right. Um, you can also tweet me at any time. If you... The YouTube comments, I try to respond to as many of them as possible. Um, sometimes I just don't know what to say, so I'll just thumbs up it, and I, I don't... Like, if you, if, you, if you... I appreciate every time anyone tells me that they are enjoying the videos. Sometimes I just don't know what to comment in in response to that i'll say thank you to a lot of them but it just seems like it gets old or seems like it's not uh genuine so i don't always do it but i do genuinely mean thank you i appreciate that a lot so if i don't respond to your comment i probably read it i probably just did not know what to say in response to it uh, alternatively, I could have missed it because it's it's quite easy to miss um, the, the comments. The way the YouTube notifications work, they are not very consistent. Sometimes I get, sometimes I will actually get four notifications about the same comment. Sometimes I get zero. It's it's kind of it, it's 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 not a great system. Uh, I so so if you want to definitely reach me you can tweet me I will always be able to I will always be getting the notifications about the tweets so hit me up on Twitter that's at CMCGDD I'm sorry it's not dog and pony there's a reason for that but it's not super important so yeah at CMCGDD uh, let me know where you think I should do live streams and that's the upcoming one, that's, uh, we're gonna stop looting after this house. That's, uh, about the Thursday live streams that I intend to get back into, if possible. That is the only thing that, uh, my new job might interfere with. I will be free during that time, but I might be exhausted. So the Thursday 1 p.m. live stream might get moved. It might, I might just stop doing it. Stop doing a uh, weekly live stream altogether for a while. I'm not super sure. That's a little up in the air um, for the time being, but I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try to do it. Next week, I'll, I'll start that up again. What else have we got going on? Um. I'm making a card game. It's got nothing to do with this channel. Let's go, ah, there's so many more buildings. Let's just go back to the car though. It's really dark. There's a glare from the window by my desk. So I can't see anything. The blinds are closed. I'm gonna have to like toss a blanket over those or something. There's, there's no way to hang curtains. Come on, come on. tapping it. I think that helps. 40? 40, 43? There we go. Uh, our chassis is probably in pretty poor condition at this point. Let's check that out.
Okay, the engine's gone. The chassis is fine. The car's gonna break down. We do have a little bit of gas, so that's nice. When we get back into a new car, we won't have to worry necessarily about running out of gas. We're not gonna try to fix it. We're not gonna punch it, because we don't, we don't, we, ow. We don't wanna, I, I'm counting on my fingers, and the way I'm gesticulating as I speak, I hit myself in the head. Um, don't, don't question that. It makes perfect sense. Uh, if we punch the car, we might get hurt. If we attempt to fix it, we're just gonna waste some time. Let's abandon it and hope that we just find a new car right now. Toll Bridge Bandits, fantastic. They want 15 food. What a bunch of jerks. We are gonna pay it. We have enough. Morale's going down, but whatever. We're still pretty darn happy. Abandon luck. Okay, that's a good one. Morale's back up. Uh, we got a, we've, it's a, it's a cabin. So we don't get anything out of it except the morale. We don't get like loot. So close. It was only uh, when they got close to it. Yeah, I know I skipped the first sentence there. Uh, that they realized it was just a giant rock. What a shame. There needs to be a pioneer mode where you can just ride around on rocks. I don't know. Maybe that should be a perk. Pioneers. Pioneer. Pioneering. I'd... Pioneer. Yeah. Oh, hey. Another uh, hybrid car. So our gas is going to go a long, long way. And um, we should be fine to keep it until the end of the uh, run, I, I think. Can shooting practice? We'll leave the camp. Don't want to... We we don't need to practice shooting. We're we're fine. I don't know why our morale went down again. That's weird. Lonely gas station. Our mechanical is terrible. We're not gonna attempt to fix the pumps. I don't want the dog getting sick. So we have enough gas. Let's leave the pumps alone. Oh yeah. So there's a contest. A, a board game design contest that I. I'm hoping to enter. I don't know if I'm gonna make the deadline. Panicking damages the chassis. Swatting the bee hurts someone. We can heal up, we've got plenty of medical supplies. Let's swat the bee. Dog and ponies hurt, that's fine. Um, Since my laptop you know, is capable of using Google Docs, but not much else, I pretty much spent the a, a, a large portion of the time that I was without my power supply working on that. Yesterday, while driving on the death road, the group decides to make a stop for supplies. Uh, I don't want to do any of this. Riled up apartment? I don't even know if we could survive that. Drive around more for 15 gas? I don't want to do a cabin rescue. We might get some food out of it, like as a reward. Let's try the cabin rescue. Siege alert, there's no escape. It didn't occur to me that that was a siege. It has been a long time since I've played, so I think that's reasonable. This is our first siege. Since, you know, we got back from the break. Let's try it. Uh, it's a rescue siege, so there's another person inside that is probably better than us at combat. Where are you, person? There you are. Uh, we're gonna let her follow us because she's gonna keep us alive, I think. If she doesn't survive, but we all do, I'm okay with that. If she does survive and Dog and Pony dies, that's fine, technically. Um, it might make it a little harder for us to find a new dog. If any of the dogs die, that's really bad for us, for the achievement uh, progress, which is, Annoying. I'd rather lose the run than win it without four dogs. It's pointless to win it without four dogs. I guess it keeps a... Do we have a streak going right now? I seem to recall being on a streak of game modes. Maybe not. Um. Yeah, so yesterday... After having been working on this game for several months, I, I started it a while ago, and I uh, stopped for a long time. I took a hiatus from it, and then came back to it, made a lot of progress, and then yesterday, last week, I hit kind of like a, 
a, a little bit of a, a road block. I couldn't move forward. I just couldn't figure out what to do. It was getting really hard to balance and I was having all these problems. Group strength training? Group strength training. And yesterday, I had an epiphany and I decided to completely refactor like 60% of the game's mechanics. And then I, I, I'm a lot happier with what, what it does now, wh how it works now. It's a lot more simple strength increase for dog and pony. Nobody else, unfortunately, but whatever. We didn't really need the rifle ammo. Million faces. Sorry, uh, Void, Alex. We are, we, we, we got to keep our dog magnet and hope that the next time we recruit someone, it's a dog. Bed and breakfast. Let's haggle it to five food. Alrighty, we're a sly one. Our morale goes up. Fantastic. Dust in pants. Like the, the the act of breathing heavily. Okay, Jackie, we're leaving you behind too. That is really bad. I don't know if we're going to get another opportunity to recruit anyone. I need a dog. Always be looting. Rest stop with car or rest stop. The engine's actually in really bad condition. This is a new car. I think we need to go to the rest stop with car. Uh, thinking calm, nightfall, check out that car. I, I'm going to keep the grenade. I was going to say I don't think we need to keep the grenade, but I changed my mind. This is a gas guzzler, so I'm glad. Oh, wow, 10. That's not great. I'm hoping there's a little bit more gas inside. It should be fine. It's really dark. The food is why I wanted to come to, uh, well, go to the rest stop without the car, because it probably would have had a little bit more food. But we still got a little bit of food here, so that's that's it's not too bad. And I lift this bench. I'm not strong enough to lift that bench, even after like multiple strength ups. I guess we did not choose a strong combo here with the charming dog magnet. In order to, oh, goodness, that's terrifying. I don't care about getting toilets. I just want to uh, kill these zombies. All right, so the keys are definitely in that room, which is, and there's, a, there's also food in there, so that's nice, but the keys are why we're doing this. If, the, if it was just the food, I would ignore the crap out of this room. All right. They stopped coming out of the door for a second, but I think we got them riled up sufficiently to, 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 to try to follow us here. All right. This is, uh, it looks like this is the bulk of the zombies. I think these are some of them from outside as well, which doesn't particularly help us, but at least we're not gonna get totally ambushed when we walk out of the building. Switch to the hatchet real quick. All right, these last two, and then we should be able to go in and loot. There might be a couple more stragglers in there, but they're not gonna be immediately a problem. This is a bathroom, so we're gonna get some toilets, which means a little bit of gasoline. Not bad. Um, not super useful, but it's something. And it, it, ultimately, it also means progress toward a toilet genie. Not in this run, I would imagine. Maybe, but I don't, I don't know. All right, and we're all set. Let's let's head out of here. I don't care about the other bathroom, so we're gonna just get back in the car. We'll get in our new car. It's not back in a car. It's a new car. We're gonna drive off. We're so close, which means the next episode will probably finish up this run. Um, 22 food is enough to finish the run. Fighter flip. Oh come on. He's not strong. I don't think he's fit either. I guess it doesn't matter if he gets hurt because we do just want to replace him. That's the ideal scenario. Uh, I'm going to try parkour. He gets hurt. His fitness is... What? I thought we had trained fitness before. I guess we trained only strength two or three times and he's still super weak. Dog and Pony is not very good at combat. Bandit watch. Who should stay up on watch? Probably Dog and Pony. Uh, I'm gonna assume his loyalty is good. 
He stays awake, but he feels pretty bad in the morning. His morale decreases. His loyalty is revealed. Okay. Dog magnet. I'm actually going to say that that is uh, all for now. But thank you for tuning in. And uh, if you enjoyed this video, make sure you click that like button. Subscribe if you want to see more in the future. I will see you in the live stream tomorrow. I hope. I hope you're there. And uh, if you're not, then I will see you in the next episode. Which may or may not be tomorrow. Because I might skip tomorrow's episode. To just, you know, because I'll be probably live streaming at that point. So it wouldn't really make sense to put out an episode tomorrow now, would it? So maybe Sunday. I'll figure it out. I will see you in the next episode.